All right, everybody. This afternoon, I'm over here in Ruffin, North Carolina. Going to be taking you through a custom Sparta 1. The Sparta 1 is 1,825 square feet. It consists of three beds, two baths. The Sparta I'm taking you through right now did a front elevation similar to our lot model. What I mean by that is they also, like our lot model, did the 6x30 raised saddle roof. So I'm referring to the raised aspect of the roof there. That's that saddle aspect of it. And then you've got the two decorative turn gables here. Yes, they are just decorative, along with that decorative window up there. But that is very similar to how we set up our uh, lot model there in Burlington, 2450 North Church Street, Burlington, North Carolina. And um, so, yeah, just a very attractive front elevation. You are seeing an example of the white vertical siding, which is very popular. You are seeing the optional black windows, of course. They do cost more than the than your included white windows, but the black gutters and downspouts are the same price as white. Our model shows um, like a brick staircase and brick columns and all this and that. This customer just stayed with the pressure treated lumber there uh, for the material for the uh, steps, pickets, posts, and decking on this porch. Very, very attractive front elevation here though. And again, this is the Sparta one. It consists of an optional slash site built front porch. You're seeing an example of the six by 30 raised saddle roof with two decorative turn gables up top and a small decorative window as well. As I've mentioned before, we have three front doors to choose from on the Sparta at no cost. That is one of them. This may be the first time you have seen this door. Um, if you've seen it before, you've only seen it once or twice. Sorry, I'm changing, taking my shoes off. So this front door would not cost you extra on the Sparta, and there are two other ones that are included as well. But here's that porch, 30 feet across, six foot in depth. Okay. Let's get in here and take a look. You've obviously seen the Sparta a handful of times, and I'm really excited to show you this one today. It's got a few things that are huge. So when you walk in, you are greeted by this huge open concept, open space area. Got my dining area to my right. Straight ahead, I have the living room, which opens up into that kitchen. So right off the bat, you'll notice that all the light fixtures, all the hinges and knobs are black, all the water faucets and all that, that tells you this customer went with the black trim package. This is me looking back at the front door and dining space. To the right off of that front door is a coat closet. I'll do my best to remember to show you that. That's that front space there. And then this living room opens up naturally into the kitchen. The Sparta kitchen across the board is definitely one of your best kitchen layouts in my opinion. Now, if you'll notice one thing is drastically different about this kitchen. This customer removed the column. I get a lot of questions about that column. It's as simple as this. On a one level, it must go. On a two level, or sorry, on a one level, it can, st uh, on a one level, it can go. A one level, it can go, the column. On a two level, it must stay. You've seen examples of other ways to work that column into the island. On our model, it is just a freestanding column, but you can work it into the island or remove it like you're seeing here. It is more expensive to remove that column. It's about 1500 bucks. Very well lit living room as far as the can lights and all the natural light coming from the two single windows and the sliding glass door. The Sparta is a, a rare plan in the sense of that sliding glass door 
is included. So you would not see a charge for that slider there where you would in like, say your Heartland plans. Um, another thing I wanted to show you, you see a lot of those apron style farmhouse sinks, whether it be undermounted or overmounted. That is the sink that we start you with there. The, so the 50-50 stainless drop-in sink. You would not see an extra cost for that sink. Very nice or you could option in the apron farmhouse sinks like you've seen. You're also seeing the under cabinet lighting along with the under mounted switches and outlets. Those are two separate things in themselves. I've had some people recently think the lighting and the, the under mounted switches are, have something to do with each other. They do not. They are two separate. Uh, things going on there so you can do one and the other or one and not the other I guess In our model we have a fireplace on this wall here Obviously this customer did not All right, the other huge change on this kitchen In our model there's an interior door there which goes to that huge walk-in pantry almost all the plans that I've taken you through for the Sparta has an a just a traditional interior door there. This is gonna be your second example of the bootlegger pantry. This is your bootlegger pantry. So it looks like cabinets. It's still accessing that awesome, huge walk-in pantry that the Sparta is always gonna be able to offer. Okay, I mean, look at all that shelving space. Tons and tons of snacks. I'm a snack guy. I could fill this thing up in a heartbeat. All right, so we're back to the kitchen. Very nice size main space here. That black hardware package um, includes that optional black chandelier that you're seeing there. the black knobs. All right, so off of this main space to my left, oh, let me show you this coat closet real quick. People get mad when I leave out little rooms like this, so. All right, so to the left here is gonna be that master suite. Here's that buffer area that that Sparta master bedroom generally has. Very nice size master bedroom. This is a 17 and a quarter by 13 and a half pretty much. So very nice size master bedroom with two windows. All the rooms come wired and braced for a ceiling fan. All right, and then what is different about, or what's different about this particular plan compared to my model is that if you were to Google the original Sparta floor plan, that is where the, the master closet is drawn to be accessed from. So that is your original closet uh, door location off of that little buffer area. We show on our model a um, alternate way to that master closet. It's in the master bath, which is accessed from a little pocket door. Check out our virtual tours on our website or um, my lot model walkthrough video. You'll see what I'm saying. But this takes the closet door back to its original location. The spar is always going to consist of a nice, large uh, walk-in closet. Tons of shelving here. Very nice size closet. Okay, and then... The model of our Sparta on the lot has just the four by eight shower. We also show a barn door on this on this entrance here. This customer went back to the original swinging door. But in our model, we basically just show a four by eight shower, which, which takes up that entire back wall. So people say, what about a tub? I say, look, the original Sparta floor plan draws a 60 inch shower and a tub. That's where it starts you with this particular bathroom. Okay, so that's what you're gonna see today. The 60 inch fiberglass shower, double vanity sink. Look at all those drawer banks there. 
tons, tons, tons and tons of storage. So you're gonna see that 60 inch fiberglass shower along with the standalone tub. This is the original or standard Sparta bathroom layout, okay? Can I add ceramic tile to this 60 inch fiberglass shower? Absolutely. Can I add soap boxes? Can I add a transom window? Can I add a rain head up top? Absolutely. But that is your um, included, no cost 60 inch fiberglass shower. Notice the black faucets, the black vanity lights, and then a water closet here. And then the always popular standalone tub, which also includes like the black faucet there, which is just really pretty classy looking. Um, going back into the master bedroom, we're gonna go across the plan to the spare bedroom side with the guest bath. I'm back in that main space. I mean, look at all that natural light, seriously. Our model shows optional transoms over that window, over the, we show an atrium door there, but a, a, a uh, transom there, there, and there. Um, obviously you don't have to do that. There's that bootlegger pantry and just the, one of the best kitchens we offer, no doubt. All right, I'll pick up my pace here a little bit. Over here, you got this kind of large open wide hallway which is nice everything's not just cramped on top of each other bath two tub shower combo there's me um very well lit from the natural uh, light tub shower pretty much where we start you in all bath twos okay That's bath two, then I've got bedroom two and bedroom three. I'm just gonna take in bedroom three today. They're both about the same size with walk-in closets. Anytime you see a globe, that tells me or tells you that room is wired and braced for a fan. So don't say, oh no, it doesn't have a can light. It's ready for a fan, which is even better. Second switch already on the wall. Those are your included two panel doors in our model of this particular plan. We showed the five panel. That's the two panel. Here's that walk-in closet. All right. And then I'll poke in bedroom two real quick. There's the closet, there's the double window. Tons of space in here. All right, and then to the left is gonna be that utility room door. Got another exterior door off the back there. Just remember like in the Heartland plans, that's we're gonna start you with a solid panel there, but in the Sparta, that is your included utility room door. Same with the Carolina Stanley or the Carolina Logan, but in the Heartland family of plans, solid panel there, you can option that in if you'd like. Very similar to the way we show our model. You've got a storage closet on my left, your washer and dryer hookup straight ahead, electrical panel box. Here's that storage closet. I can work a sink in here, absolutely. I can, I'm just gonna move that return somewhere, use that area there for a sink or what have you. All right, guys, so again, this is the Sparta One, 1825 square foot. Oh, you had the plan over here, I wanna show you. 1825 square foot, 66 foot across, 27 foot, eight inches deep. Front door here, I am standing about right here. Got the spare bedrooms over here, master suite over here. Got that bootlegger pantry there. As you can see from the plan, this front porch is optional. It is not included in the plan, so you tell me what you want. You saw a six by 30 today, raised saddle roof with two turn gables up top. We'll talk about the front. We'll have a long conversation about the front elevation there. Uh, you ask what is standard, uh, there really isn't a standard. You're gonna tell me 
what you want out front because again, it doesn't come with a porch like some of my other plans do. So again, this is the Sparta One. We have this at our uh, uh, sales center up in Burlington. It's located at 2450 North Church Street, Burlington, North Carolina, zip 27217. Our number is 336-226-9066. I am Shields, S-H-I-E-L-D-S. My email is Shields, S-H-I-E-L-D-S, at NC Custom Modulars with an S dot com. If you haven't already subscribed, please do so. Please go down there and like this video. And please comment if you got any questions or call me or email me or whatever you want to do. So thank you guys. Sparta One. We have the Sparta on display. I'm dying to have you out there, so you're around. Enjoy.